our real time PCR machine. And it looks pretty and small. And it comes with the little chip, PCR chip. Okay. And real time PCR is for amplify your DNA, and so you can see your DNA quantity amount with the signal. And this laptop is comes with this instrument. There is our software. So this software is control our all the instruments. This is a chip for our real time PCR. So one channel is for one sample, and this totally 16 samples. And first, you should, we should make a mixture for the PCR. Okay. So let's make a PCR mixture. Okay. I will use this salmonella detection kit inside of the kit. You can see these four different tubes. One is master mix and prime proof mixture and pass control DNA and PCR grade water. I will use two samples. One is negative, the other one is positive. Take five microliter of the mixture put it into the tube and one more for the positive and using three microliter of the positive control DNA It's a positive sample. And now it's done. And slightly tapping to mix it. And use the centrifuge for spin down. I will take only 8 microliter of this 10 microliter reaction mixture and then put your keep in the middle of the hole vertically and then press your pipe in. Now you can see the flow inside of the channel. Eight microliter, and then go to this way. Now our chip is ready, so we need to assemble chip and chip case. So place your chip in the middle of the chip case, and then place your rubber ceiling the cover of the chip case like this and then close the case and work it okay. okay and move the software in the operation tab when you click this chip out button okay. the door will be open automatically okay and then insert your chip case okay Button okay. And now it's time to go to the camera calibration tape. Click this camera move button. Now you can see the inside of the channel. Okay. And here, click the ROI show button. And make sure every ROI position is correct with the channel. And you can control this channel, uh, ROI with the keyboard. And then click the save. Make sure you got your own your, your test protocol or you can make your own protocol. And when it's all ready, go to the operation and then click the run button and make a new folder in anywhere you want. Put your sample name or my name and now it's a start. Okay. And it takes around 70 minutes for this kit. 
during this time, when you go to this cycle parameter, you can check your sample or you can save your sample name. After that, finish the PCR, just take out the cartridge and then remove all the parts to discard. Then keep this case. When the PCR is finished, you click this OK button. Like this, you can see the new software window. And when you go to the operation tab, you can get the city value of your samples. When, when you sample get the city value, this mark is going to be green. And there is no city value, it just stays with the red sign. And if you want to see the bit graph, click this curve fitting button. And here you can see this curve fitted graph. And when you click the channel number, you can see this the bright. And in here, in the data process tab, you can get the result with the Excel file. And when you click the right button on the graph, you can copy the graph or you can save this image as a BMP file.